She's done. She's destroyed. She is destroyed. The Montreal police dive team have put an end to their search of the river that runs along the Ahuntsic Cartierville Park, where Ariel Jeffrey Kuaku was last seen over a week ago. After six dives over two days, Montreal police found no new clues to help them solve this mystery. They say if they get new information that warrants a dive, they'll go back in. But the boy's parents are not losing hope. They are adamant their 10-year-old son was kidnapped. It simply means that our son didn't go there. This is the feeling that we have, and we strongly believe that our son has been kidnapped. Police continue to investigate video surveillance footage and go door to door with the help of volunteers. Making people understand that it's, we're not giving up and to give any information that's irrelevant, that they think that's irrelevant, please come and send the information to the police. Ariel was last seen in the park by a woman on Monday afternoon after he walked to a friend's place and he wasn't there. He never made it home after that. Maybe she can tell us more about what she, said, she saw that we, we, we don't know. These are the most frustrating cases of uh, missing children because we don't have a crime scene. We have nothing except the eyewitness account that uh, uh, of a woman that stepped forward to say that she had crossed paths with uh, Ariel. The parents are now offering a $100,000 reward to anyone who helps find their son. You're playing against time. The first few hours are very important because children displace themselves. They move much f faster than any an elderly or and they'll go in places that would, an adult wouldn't even think of. For City News in Montreal, I'm Tina Teneriello.